extremely helpful I think in terms of initially if you if you're ill it's just standard these days that you'll search on the internet possibly before approaching your GP for further information. If you've got a specific concern or have been diagnosed, for example, um, my mum actually had, um, was diagnosed with terminal cancer, so I think what the GP can provide in these circumstances is limited to time um, per patient, etc. So in looking at nutrition and how um, best to manage a condition, um, the internet is incredibly useful uh, to research um, support charities in that area, further information on the conditions and how to manage the conditions um, best in terms of professional advice um, where your GP hasn't really got the time um, and resources to do that. So in instances like that it's you know incredibly useful. You can go to the general common known websites um, but if it's specific for example in terms of like researching homeopathic alternatives again diet and nutrition and a bit more about what to kind of expect in terms of managing the condition um, yeah it's vital in terms of being linked then to um, alternative organizations um, with very specific um, information because I think in a situation like that obviously it's quite shocking mm. um, and so you then kind of go into panic research mode if you will um, to you know try and get as much information as possible about uh, the diagnosis and, and opinions um, and um, not specifically in the case of my mum but in terms of what's out there in uh, support and um, the care provision available which is ne not necessarily linked to your GP practice or the NHS particularly.